So, as I'm recording this video, if you guys already know that Roblox will have a new event which is called the Games that will start tomorrow on August 1st until the 12th of August, which is, um, as you know, that uh, currently we are now in the Olympics Games, which is uh, currently going on right now. So, I believe uh, this event is like, uh, you know, having things with olympics so in this video i'm going to give you my pre-review on like um the event what you need to know about this event and also uh, my honest opinion on like some certain stuff so first of all let's start with the prizes um the prizes for this event is kind of you know it's kind of meh to me uh this is uh, the league prize um for the event uh is uncertainly sure what the prize is gonna be like all because this like completely different than the other two past events that we have so this is the league prizes that we have right now to be honest it's kind of like meh to me it's mostly like layered clothing and all um to me like i don't know if i like this but it looks you it looks okay but i don't know like if i'm not if i'm gonna wear it you know so yeah maybe it's still i'm gonna participate in this event but still the prizes for me to this event is i think a bit downgraded from the past two events so um yeah that's for the prizes and for the games uh, that will be participated uh it, they are being rumored that more than 50 games will be in this event which is a lot more than the classic event and a bit less than the hunt so um to me i think it's okay i think it's fair like 50 games you know i think it's fine um uh, but I also heard from uh, the leakers uh, that I saw on Twitter. Um, probably the quest is a bit fun, like quite a bit fun, and also not gonna be as grindy. But I think there will be some games that will take the opportunity to make the event quest grindy. So yeah, um, stay execution filled there. <laughs> I can I can predict that. Um, so yeah, these are the rumored games that's gonna be in the event. And um, there are also some games that has been in the past two events or like one of the two events joining back. And some of them also is new, like for example, like Epic Mini Games, um, Tokyo Racing and much more that is related to the Olympics, right? Because, you know, racing, I know it's not Olympic stuff, but still, you know, like uh, Epic Mini Games. There are some games that is related to the Olympics, so and some of them are not. So I guess we're gonna wait and see how the quest go. Because uh, for example, like dress to impress, um, they giving out prizes. Uh, if we participate and you know wins in the game or something, uh, there are also some other games like Funky Friday, Ro um, Robits will also be in this. So there's some like, you know, like the games that supposedly being in like the past two events and now they come out for the uh, for the third event, which is pretty good. But still, there's some bad games for the past two games like Blade Box coming back, Pool of Swords coming back, Obi-Wan Bike is coming back. Uh, I really hope their quest is like, uh, don't please don't be like last time. Like uh, it's so it's so a disaster and also it's a pain. You know, when doing that, hopefully they don't do that again. I mean, if they did that again, I guess we all know. <laughs> so that's for the games. Oh, and also I forgot to mention here that um, in this event also we have like premium rewards. Like Bows 2 events, we have a gold tracks, you know. So I can, uh, there is also a leak that there will be a premium items as well that you can purchase by Robux. So it's not like forcing you to buy. So if you really want more extra, more rewards, then if you want to buy it, then sure, you can go ahead and buy it. So now let's head over to teens because this is the different things uh, from the past two events in which before you playing just individually but this time is um with teams just like you know back in like metaverse champions and also rb battles uh this is the combination of those two you know so there will be five teams which is the first team is crimson cast which is Critcraft, uh lana ray and also night force in which Critcraft has the captain the second team is pink warriors consisting of ibella mr Bushot, and also pink leaf in which ibella is the team captain the third one is angry canary uh, insisting of ibugo dudu betero and y2wack i believe this team 
is the like representing a uh, Brazilian. So that's a uh, unique stuff, you know, in this event. Um, and then the next one is giant feet, uh, consisting of me and you, uh, socks for three, and also Project Supreme, in which uh me uh and you will be the team captain. Uh, and also the final team is Team uh, Mighty Ninjas, in, uh, consisting of Betrana, Y, Noangi, Rakunidas, and also Rovi23. Uh, this one, this team is representing Spanish uh, YouTubers. So yeah, so there will be three English representation, uh, one Spanish and also one Brazilian. In which like you know it's kind of unique. So um, take that. But there is downside of this. Uh, first one is. People worried that this is gonna be a popularity contest. I mean, based on it, it's already known it's gonna be like popularity contest. Just like back, what happened in Metaverse Champions? I played Metaverse Champions. I know what happens. Like people playing on Sparks Kilowatt much more because the games there is like the the games for her. You know, to win is like easier to get uh, easier to win easier to get rather than the other teams but for this one is different because you have to play uh, you have to join a team and then of course you have to play all 50 games and if you play all the 50 games you get all the badges of course you're gonna have your team to win um actually that's based on leaks as well I, and i think that will be a reality when the game uh, the event is started so um yeah um i can see two teams in the top like it's gonna fight rather than five so it's gonna be Creek's team which is team crimson cast and also a news team uh, which is a team giant feet uh, in which at first people is gonna go for giant feet <laughs> team feet uh, in twitter but now it's like you know when Creek's going for team crimson cast of course people's gonna go for that because Creek is a big YouTuber, right? And he also just hit 10 million subscribers. So I'm just going to say congrats in this video uh, uh, for 10 million. He really deserve it. Um, but in terms of this event, though, uh, it's not going to going well because the popularity contest, right? People's going to go for like, oh, oh my God, it's Creek. I'm going to join his team, you know, rather than other four teams. Um, so yeah, I can see this going to be like a popularity contest and I can see Creek's team is going to win this like 100 percent i mean if there's like limitation like uh, uh like how many players can join each team that would be great you know but i don't think roblox can do that you know i don't see like how they're gonna execute that i mean it would be better two times better if roblox did that but i don't see how roblox can execute that how they are gonna do it so yeah that's gonna be a little bit unfair i can see that's gonna be like a bad thing about this event at the end so yeah, and one thing I'm scared about this thing as well when there's teams like I'm scared if at the end of this event, whichever teams that top the uh, top the event, of course, um, will get their own special items. By that I mean like you know grand prize to teams who win, and those teams who join that team that wins will only get it. Just like back in like RB battles, I know making this a bit non comparison, but like if you vote those uh, uh predict who wins in the RB battles, you get that item, and those who predicting wrong, you're not gonna get it. So, yeah, I can see that's coming. So. Yeah, that would be one of the things that Robloxians or the, you know, Roblox community is going to be mad of. Um, even myself, I'm going to be very disappointed. So, like, I think people's going to, if they, if the players know that this thing's going to come, I think they're going to go for quick steam. Uh, but I think, as I said just now, there will be two things going to fight each other, which is um, quick steam and also a new steam, which is the giant feet team. Um, I don't see the other three teams going to be you know fight but maybe i'm wrong you know who knows right um but i think creek's team is gonna get a lot of people to join rather than the other team so yeah that's a sad thing um i think this is another bad execution by roblox as well in terms of like you know this style i mean i love this kind of style i love it but like if you mix in if and a prize for those team that wins that would be so unfair and i can think i can see that from mile away this event's gonna get hit it because of that that is the main reason of that so uh yeah that is the teams that will be in this um 
event and I'm kind of a bit excited, you know, kind of excited because this is a unique thing. And also the quest I heard is some of the games doing well. So I guess we're going to wait and see when this event started tomorrow then. So yeah, that is all for my pre-review or giving you like what you need to know about the game's event. And as I said just now, the event will be starting tomorrow until the 12th of August. So you have more time to play um, rather than uh, the classic event. So yeah, um, I really hope this event is a bit better than the past event. You know, so it can be better than the hunt. Because if not, um, I think the these three roblox events like the revival of the roblox event is pointless you know what i mean and i'm just saying right now in this video i'm gonna point out right now that there are two main reasons why this event failed first one is a popularity contest as i mentioned just now like um there are teams and those teams have like big youtubers like for example creek is in team freezer cast of course everybody's gonna go for that um, but still there will be like um you know fight between team cast and team feet i can see that coming as i said just now so um yeah leaving those other teams like the popularity is low and those games not gonna win and if there is code on code special rewards those team that are win i can see the hate of this game is gonna go berserk you know what i mean so yeah I, I i think i can see that coming from far away so if i'm right i'm probably gonna make like you know put this like flashback thing right so i guess we'll see about it and the second one of course the execution of this event by that i mean like on the games themselves like the quest the choosing of the games uh, maybe there are some games that is good some of game might mess this up just like the past events so this thing has always you know the thing for the past event so i'm not surprised if this thing will be one of the factors that this event is also going to be failed so yeah if i'm right i will probably make this like the intro of the video and then just like yeah so i was right <laughs> so um thank you so much for watching and of course um i will play in this event myself like um off camera i'm only gonna be recording it um and then of course i will make like posts review on like what i think about this event also the criticism and all because i can see that it's coming as always every time a roblox doing something right with, with this event i mean people can voice their own opinion right so yeah uh make sure to give a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out my post review on this the games event so have fun um playing this event uh, including myself so i'll see you guys in the post review event uh once the event is over bye bye